tip is just to take the, the things that you want in your life, whether it's to, you know, be more confident or to, you know, have more, you know, have more success or, or you know, better health and just start uh, modeling the behavior that you want. And once you act that way for a while, you'll start to feel those feelings and become that person and start to have those things. And that's always been true for me, but um, I wanted to give you a little more tools to work with. But first, I want to give you an analogy. And this is something I've been saying a lot lately to, to my friends in my life, is that everybody wants the, the golden egg, but nobody wants to feed the goose. Like Everybody wants the good stuff, like the health, wealth, the wisdom, but uh, people are slow to actually do the things that you need to do to keep the golden goose alive. And this analogy, you're the golden goose. You're the thing, you're the person that could give you, give yourself all the things that you want. And only through that slow process of self-care and taking care of, your, of yourself and managing your, your energy and your life the way that you want to, that, that's the only way that you get to these places. But luckily we have a lot of help because uh, people like the Tim Ferriss podcast and folks like Manager Day to Day are, are able to break down the, the habits that the most successful, most creative, uh, most vital, and most uh, impactful people in our time, uh, uh, their habits are broken down and made public, so you can, you can start to model them. And <clears throat> a few years ago, I, uh, I got to observe a great model. I was at a, a powerlifting meet, and I got to watch uh, one of my uh, uh, idols now, Chris Duffin, squat four times his body weight. Super exciting, really amazing. It's, it's awesome. I was very inspired. And um, immediately I started thinking, gosh, well, what could I do to, what could I do to start creating, you know, a body that was that powerful and that strong? And uh, I'm going to break down the process of identifying the habits to model. In this case, it's a powerful body, right? So I start to get into detail about what it takes to have that physicality. So people who are in that kind of shape, that level, that elite level, train five times a week on a very balanced and in uh, optimum strength and conditioning program. And they were sleeping at least seven hours a day, and that's a lot for me. So I wrote down seven because that's what I was willing to commit to getting to that level. But um, I'm willing to sleep at least that much. Uh, they eat simple, healing foods, and uh, that's, I have access to that. You know, I'm in, in Portland, a food mecca. Uh, I, they do soft tissue work, they do mobility work, but some research, I understand that. They hydrate, there's a lot more than these, but I'm just giving you some of the big ones. Yeah, they supplement with like simple things like creatine. Uh, they, they maintain a nutrition plan, and then uh, there's lots of resources I could get, books and coaching on detail about all of these things. But when I drilled a little deeper, I looked at it's like, gosh, you know, uh, I actually it doesn't cost me that much more time. See, so yeah, if you have a gym membership or if you're if you're around a gym, you actually can you can get that those extra workouts in without paying any more money. It just takes a little bit more energy. The sleep, obviously, that's free. Uh, eat simple healing food. This actually saves you money because then you're not spending money on junk and, and, and eating out. Uh, soft tissue work. Just Google self myofascial release. You can start to figure out how to do that on yourself. Mobility work. Same thing. Just do a little bit of research. Uh, Kelly Starrett's mobility workout of the day or mobility of the day uh, website. Great. Great stuff that you can, you can execute on yourself. Obviously, water's free. Luckily, we live in America. Uh, creatine, that's a cheap supplement that works, 20 bucks. Uh, nutrition planning, another thing, once you, once I started making a nutrition plan, I was actually saving even more money, because now I'm pre-planning my meals, I'm making them in advance, they're what I need, I feel great, and I'm not spending money on, on things that are, uh, or eating out, or, or junk food, or ice cream. Okay, maybe a little bit of ice cream, but not too much. Uh, but actually, I actually saved time and money when I started to live this way, and I was happier and I was on the path. And I'm obviously I'm a long way from being able to squat four times my body weight. Mad respect, Chris. <clears throat> but uh, I'm on the path. And to speed up my progress, I could do more research and I could even hire a coach. And, and that, will, that will help me get to where I want to go a little bit faster. But breaking down the habits one at a time and starting to take them on one at a time. It's, it's, it's everywhere. We all have access to this now, like luckily because of the internet and the technological age. We can all act as if. We can start to feed that golden goose and start to get the good stuff from it. And it's, uh, uh, the, the habit that I would like to instill in you is, is, a, uh, is the, the, the um, mantra of, if it is going to be, it's up to me. And I know you can do it. All right, guys. Act as if. And I'll be <laughs> giving you as much as I can to help you bring out the warrior within. This is Coach Josh from Training for Warriors Portland.